past life oracle cards okay so this ones are gonna give us uh, an idea of what we've been in another timeline in another era when we existed okay because our souls have been you know in this adventure here on multi dimensions at the same time and so it's good to know where we come from okay let's tap into the past life okay? So for feathers, we have the medicine man and woman. Wow, you saw how it landed on the feathers, right? Previously, we have medicine man or woman, okay? So indigenous, okay, indigenous DNA. Okay, so what this is saying is that uh, you've been part of a tribe, okay? If you were to do your um, a DNA um, analyzation or investigation, you would find that out that you have uh, a strong uh, air, D uh, indigenous DNA. Then for clouds, for clouds, we have finances, okay? So uh, being wealthy in the past lifetime, all right? Perhaps you were part of creating um, the monetary system, okay, back in the days, you know, um, back in that lifetime. Um, hydromancy, illusion, we have the arts, okay, a musician. So in another timeline, the you were part of a, a, a music band, okay, playing different instruments, a, pro, a musician prodigy. All right, playing the piano, the harp, food, violin, okay, the saxophone, any of those or any other instruments that I didn't mention. Okay, the thunder and lightning power, scribe or writer. Okay, some of these were um, writers. Um, you recorded uh, history. You recorded uh, important events from that timeline, okay? You're uh, a scroll writer. Okay, then we have father for the alchemy, and then we have wisdom for our ornithomancy. With the omen is wisdom, all right? Um, some of you existed where the unicorns come from, and uh, they do exist. They're in a different timeline, different dimension. All right, um, I have seen them, and they have come out in my pictures when I do rituals in previous years. For alchemy and spells, we have the father figure, okay? Um, strong Sagittarius, Leo, and Aries energy here, okay? And imprisonment or slavery, right? That's with the aura, all right? So um, some of you were victims of uh, uh, being accused of being a witch, being accused, falsely accused of uh, committing some type of crime, okay? Um, this is what this, uh, this is indicating, okay? Um, so... Some of you were very knowledgeable when it came to uh, healing, the healing properties of, you know, of, you know, herbs and, and um, how to use spices and stuff like that or nature into medicinal properties, right? Um, some of you were so good in, in, um, in being, um, What's it called? The uh, parteras, you know, the 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 ones that are 
in charge of um, uh, midwives. There you go. Thank you, Lord. Uh, midwives to, you know, um, and, you know, when the doctor was not available, midwives were available or vice versa. Midwives would help uh, doctors and stuff like that um, to, in order for children to come to earth, right, to be birthed, right? Um, and it's depending how far the hospital was or the clinic or, um, you know, sometimes births are out of nowhere and, you know, you go through the... Um, um through the pain and 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 uh and to avoid miscarriages or whatnot you know you would uh, depend on midwives to um a, to help with birthing your your children right so father figure here all right some of you were good in in creating spells or spell casting um being oracles some of these were accused of knowing too much so back in in different timelines uh um there was a lot of atrocities or a lot of like um abuse you know and a lot of false accusations if you were way too intelligent or had too much knowledge then you would be considered a witch or a devil worshiper or evil practitioner and whatnot right if you had too much money and and people had suspicions of you being a thief or of you um you know being a, a whore or a, a a sex you know a prostitute or you know a sex slave or whatever you know and selling your body then you know you would be accused and and therefore the uh torturous um um it would require for certain individuals to be uh, tested and and their lives would depend on 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 rumors right that would cause individuals to to that would risk individuals lives and therefore you know get tortured to death right um since there was no TV or cell phones at those times individuals uh would use um you know crimes as an excuse to you know get entertained and uh or just um use individuals as slaves to um uh, you know throw them with the uh, wild animals and and see and getting entertained on how they get like you know eaten alive or tear apart by wild animals such as tigers or lions or any uh snakes or you know stuff like that you know um there was a lot of uh torture devices being used um in order to discipline uh, the community or the uh, the society and bring some type of fear you know and so they created the imprisonments but even when with the jail or in, or the uh, prison system, the judicial system is still is still very corrupted uh, as we know it. A lot of violence, uh, and there is more damage that is being done mentally to uh, criminals or so-called criminals, right? Um, and now what we notice is that there is a lot of individuals that instead they commit horrendous crimes or heinous crimes and and instead of you know uh, getting rid of them or you know and uh, they allow them to be in prison for a long period of time which is very ridiculous especially for the amount of crimes they've done you know we're talking about sociopaths psychopaths uh, narcissist individuals, con artists, scam artists, um, just uh, murderers, right? Um, serial killers and whatnot, right? That I feel that they shouldn't exist uh, for no, there's no reasons to give these individuals uh, uh, to allow them to live among us, right? 